Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a fun, bright summer slash spring makeup tutorial. So today I really, really was in the mood of just playing with really bright makeup. Now in this tutorial you will see me use some new sponges such as this one, this um, lime green and then this pink one as well. This is by the same brand where I use my favorite br brushes which is Beauty Junkies and I actually have an extra little bag to do as a giveaway. Now I am going to be doing this one for Instagram only so make sure you're following me on Instagram. I will have the rules and my Instagram name to what you can do. Um, I will have another giveaway coming either this week or next week for YouTube only but this is going to be an Instagram giveaway only so make sure you're following me. My throat is like hurting for some weird reason so I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let me know what you think. I know that it's very bright and I like it. I hope you guys like it as well and let's go ahead and get started. Hey guys! So we are starting with the bare face. Now we're taking the Scandinavia, the makeup, well this is actually the primer spray for oily skin. I'm just going to bathe myself in it. And I'm going to take the Born This Way foundation in the color sand and I'm going to take this pink um, foundation sponge. This is by Beauty Junkies. This sponge is so awesome. I love it. It is so like fluffy in texture. It really reminds me a lot of the Beauty Blender and I do use it damp. Now I'm going to take the Naked Skin Concealer and I believe mine is in light medium. I am running out of it so I definitely have to go pick a new one up. Same routine, I apply it underneath my eyes, in the center of my nose, the center of my forehead as well as on my chin. As you can see my skin is currently freaking out but it's getting a little bit better. I'm gonna take this blue little sponge from that same um, brand of Beauty Junkies. This one is definitely my favorite one because it's so good to bake with. As you can see, I bake underneath um, my eyes, the chin, the forehead. And then this just allows you to bake underneath your cheekbones so perfectly so it'll chisel them out. I'm gonna take my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in deep, dark deep, I believe. Um, it is a little bit orangey, but it works. I make it work. So I'm just going to apply that all over my forehead. As well, I'm going to take this brush. This is by Luxie Beauty. That's the Small Contouring 512. I love this brush. It's so awesome. I will make sure to try and link more brushes for you guys because you guys always ask me. And then this brush that I use to just dust off any powder, I believe I purchased it on eBay a while ago. I will try to find the set for you guys and again link it down below. So after that I'm just going to take a sibling brush and I'm going to make sure that I blend everything out since I did bake my face. I want to make sure that there are no harsh lines so I just pretty much take that all over and I just buff everything out. Now I'm going to take this golden bronzer by the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kits. Since I'm not going to be applying any blush, I wanted to have really glowy, bronzy skin so I just applied that. And then I mixed these two colors for my highlight and as you can see, it is gorgeous. I absolutely love it. The only thing is that with highlights, it really shows your texture skin, especially right now that I'm breaking out. You can really see pretty much all my imperfections but I really don't care. I love highlights so don't be afraid to pack it on even if you have textured skin. I also like to take that to my cupid's bow just so I can define my cupid's bow a little bit more and then to the tip of my nose. I'm going to take the Scandinavia Finishing Setting Spray again for oily skin. Ugh, guys, this stuff is amazing. I'm going to take this green little sponge and I'm just going to push all the product into my skin so it can blend and it looks like actual skin, not just powder. I swear by this Scandinavia stuff. I really, really, really like it. I will have a link to where you can actually purchase them if you guys are interested. Highly recommended for oily skin. Now I'm going to take me my, me, my NYC liquid eyeliner. This is in the color black. I love this. This is my holy grail. I just, I can't live without my eyeliner. And this look is very simple, but at the same time, it's very bright and super awesome for spring and summer. And I'm just drawing my regular wing. You can do either really thick or rather thin since we're going with a second eyeliner. But I just kind of winged it and I just went with whatever was happening at the moment. 
I'm gonna take this NYX Vivid Brights eyeliner in yellow. Unfortunately, this did not work out. I was really hoping that it wasn't going to crack like the white one, but it does crack. Um, the more that you apply it and as it dries, it does crack as you can see. I don't know if you can see it on the camera actually, but I did go back and I applied some of my black eyeliner just to kind of perfect the lines so they can be really nice and clean. But yeah, definitely try a, maybe a different eyeliner. Now I did go with this ColourPop Gel Eyeliner in yellow, I believe it's called. I will have a name if that's not the right name, but these are amazing. I really like it. That was my first time trying it as well, and I really, really, really liked it. Then I applied some mascara and my lashes. Now for lip liner, I'm going to go with this Italia lip liner in the color Fuchsia, and I'm just going to line my lips, as you can see. I do overdraw the top just a tad bit, and then through the rest of my lips I just kind of you know tend to follow the natural line so yeah I'm just going to line my lips and also bring it in and then with this color pop liquid lipstick um, this is in the color highball gorgeous Barbie pink color and I'm just going to apply that to my lips and that is pretty much it super simple right I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to follow me on Instagram to enter this small giveaway I will have more to come Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!